you haven't been in, so July would have been. Yeah, it's supposed to come in in three months. Yeah, it's been six. So, all right. So, we'll go ahead and we'll. That's okay though. It looks like you've been taking pretty good care of your nails. I've been trying. Yeah, they don't look bad. Good. And I assume that if they were hurting, you would have been in sooner. I would have. So many of our patients can't reach their feet to take care of their own nails. Oh. You know, so if you can, three or four months might be plenty for you. In between, you might not. I guess the callus would be what determines how quickly yeah. you need to come in. Yeah. So. Was something going on toward the end of the year? Or? Um. Yeah, we were we were traveling a little bit. So. Oh, anywhere good? Well, New York. Um, always good. Always good. And um, we did spend about six or seven weeks at the beginning of this year in Florida. And I'm, I'm not really a big fan of Florida, but it is nice when it's 20 below here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to be picky about it. We had a chance to um, go stay with some people. And, and looking at your photos reminded me of, I've become very interested in alligators and mm -hmm. large iguanas. And I don't know what you call that. That is a picture of a marine iguana. Okay. That's off the coast of Ecuador. Very cool. Yeah. They what what sparked this interest? Well, I guess because I I don't know. I I love the ocean but I I'm not that crazy about the rest of Florida. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, I don't. I I started reading about <coughs> the area, and um, oh, were you staying inland? When yes, you were there? yes. Okay. And we, uh, you know, there are places that tourists can go and look at alligators, and that we did that once. But we found a a real kind of deserted swamp like uh, area. It was just fascinating. It looked like you were in a time warp. Um, and there were very few people and the alligators were kind of hanging around and, and really trying to stay away from people. Yes, they generally do. Yeah. Unless it's a Sharknado movie or something. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I don't know. I just found them. I just found them interesting to to watch and um, and to learn a little more about them. Like they don't. If you're driving down the road, they don't jump out of the swamp and <laughs> into your window and eat you. Yeah. Um, I, you know, was cautious. But then also, I don't know if you've ever been to Fort Lauderdale. I have not. Um, it was the last thing I expected to see, but we were walking along. They have a river walk, and I heard this noise in a tree, and here was a rather large iguana coming down to get some sun. It was pretty, pretty interesting to watch them. And then I kind of got into that, too, watching um, the iguana. How big was it? Or are they everywhere? No, they're... They're not everywhere. The little littler ones are. This one was maybe three feet long. Is that considered smaller? Um, or that's a larger one? That's a larger one, okay. yeah. And it's kind of, it was very interesting to get close to him or her until they ran away. Yeah. But, um, yeah, this is really, this one is really a great picture. I had a friend who went to St. John's, and she said that the big iguanas would just be swimming in the pool. Really? Yeah, and they'd come up and like eat your food off your plate and stuff. <laughs> I can't believe I'd be, I'd probably be really scared at first. I would too. <laughs> wow.
sometimes you cut a little more off the, the outside side over here because there's, yeah, because um, there's pressure kind of. Thing. They cut it pretty far down this time for you. You can take a look and tell me if you want me to cut more. Okay. I'm done. Thank you. So are iguanas carnivores? Or no. Oh, okay. So um, they're not they're not gonna come after you. Right, except when they're bigger you <laughs> I'm a little, you know, like wonder I wonder if you would I don't know if they have I mean, <laughs> you know, like pelican they, there's pelicans there too, and they just Follow everything I like. Yeah. But um, people were uh, people around there were putting out lettuce for the iguana. Oh, okay. Um, That's a pretty clear indication. Yeah. I Instead don't of feeding deer, you feed iguanas. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So um, I know. So this looks good, and we're gonna come around the other side and do the cows video. When did you start doing the videoing? About a year ago, maybe. Well, I'll have to check it out. Yeah. We just passed 50,000 subscribers last night. Really? And over 20 million views, so that's very exciting. <sighs> People watch for all kinds of different reasons, but <laughs> you can be a rock star on YouTube. I wonder if I'll recognize my own feed. Well, you'll be the video where we're talking about alligators and iguanas. Oh, okay. <laughs> and this, this was in Ecuador? Yeah, those uh, photographs are from the Galapagos Islands. Oh, that's right. You have other, you have bull-footed boobies. I do. I yeah. That's my dream vacation. Is it Galapagos? Oh, yeah. It was absolutely a once-in-a-lifetime wonderful. See, I just know. I've been wanting to go there for years. I have been to Ecuador, but um, my, my husband says, we'll save the Galapagos. We'll take a cruise. How did you get there? Plane or um, ship? We flew from Quito oh. out uh, I'm trying to think. We flew from Quito to to the Galapagos. One of the islands does have a landing, an airport on it, and then from there we caught the ship that we took. Um, but you can also cruise from Guayaquil, which is the um, which is the coastal city. Yes. There. I got close. Oh, you were in Guayaquil? Yes. Um, we had not, you know, checked out transportation before we got to Ecuador. Mm -hmm. They were saying you should have done something months ago. Okay, well this all looks good. Um, 
So hopefully this will keep for another four months or so. That's my favorite part. No, this was a, a, a viewer. Oh. I said, you didn't do the lotion. That's my favorite part. So this is for you. And you. How soon will this be on? Probably within the month. Check it out. Oh, that does feel good. All right. Thank you.